hello. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. It's been a pleasure. There you go. Hermes. I do have Mr. David Uribe. He was not here yesterday, but I'm so happy that he's here. Very good. I got Fabiola. Hey, Fabi. Very good. I do have Caesar. My man Merlin Adonai. It's been a pleasure. Francisco. Uh, good, evening, teacher. good evening, sir. With our Wilfredo. German. Linda. Flor. Julia. We have Carlos Pineda. All righty. Yvette. Ooh. All right. No, Norberto, we have you here. Very good. Excellent. We have a lot of people here. Excellent job. Thank you so much for being on time, guys. Hey, how you guys doing today? How you feel today? Oh, yes, one at a time, please. One at a time, please. Yes, of course. Yes. Mm -hmm. Fine, teacher. It was fine. a busy day, but, but fine. Yes, it was a beautiful day. Okay. Tell us a little bit about your day. What did you do today? Uh, work a lot. I mm -hmm. feel a little bit tired, but it's things of the work. It yes. Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I, I know. I'm I'm so happy that you're here, even <laughs> though you're tired. But I want if you can provide me details, information of what 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 did you do today? Uh, to practice simple uh, fast a little bit. My profession is about to manage a software program, so mm -hmm. I need to give support to the final user, but today we have a couple of troubles with the system. We have or we had? We have, I'm sorry, teacher. Mm -hmm. yeah. We no, have worry, a couple of troubles with the, with the system, and I'm, I'm, I'm in charge to solve it, so okay. it was... a. Uh, 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 quite complicated. Wow. At what time did you wake up today? Um, a little bit late, about 7, 7 a.m. Oh, lucky you. Okay. At what time did you have your lunch today? Um, around 1 p.m. 1 p.m. Did you already have dinner or no yet? Yeah, I already yeah. have dinner, yet. Yeah. Okay. Did you cook? I ah, to come on. No. Uh, it was your mama? It was your wife? Uh, no, because today we we eat pupusas. So you ate pupusas? We ate pupusas. Yep. That's nice. So, Lucky him, right? With a hot chocolate. Mm -hmm. With a coffee. Oh, excuse me, with a cup of coffee. Cup oh, of oh, coffee. All right, may I apologize, all righty. Oh, that's good, excellent. <laughs> Great job. Thank you so much for sharing your day today, Adonai. All righty, okay, who else? Um, <laughs> thank you for participating so much, Hermes. Thank you. <laughs> good night. Good night. Okay, tell us a little bit about your day. What did you do today? Um, I'm working with uh, many projects in my company. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that it's very late, but I tried. I tried to do my best effort to learn to speak English. And I'm so happy learn. that you're here. Also, it was really hard day for you as Marlon, right? <laughs> Tough day. I can't imagine. Mm -hmm. At what time did you wake up today, Hermes? Uh, uh, seven, seven o'clock. Seven o'clock, okay. 30 minutes yes. early than Marlin. All righty. And uh, what did you have for lunch? Uh, I don't remember. Come on, you don't remember. <laughs> Uh, it could be a Maruchan, that's okay. <laughs> and it was that, right? I like, I like <laughs> you like Maruchan. it, you see? I told you, I knew it. <laughs> All righty. That's good. <laughs> that's good, excellent. Yes, it is good, yeah. All righty, and uh, at what time do you have your lunch? At 1 or 12 noon? Uh, you don't uh, remember. At how? You don't remember either, no. 
<laughs> Do you already have your dinner or not yet? Yes. Yes. Okay. What did you eat? Pupusas. No. Pupusas. Yeah. Pupusas oh my goodness. All right. You you need to pay attention, guys. Okay. All righty. That's today nice. Is the day of pupusas. This is pupusas day. Pupusas day. Pupusas day. All righty. And uh, okay. And also with a cup of coffee. Ah, you see, I told you, all right, okay. Very good, you need to pay attention, okay, guys? Aha, Erika, thank you so much for joining today's class. Like, I knew she was going to ask me. All righty, Erika, how was your day? Tell us a little bit about your day. It's fine. It's fine, okay. At what time did you wake up? Uh, this, uh, five o'clock. Five a.m.? Yes. Woohoo! you see, guys, she's an early bird nor a night owl okay early bird okay tell me at what time do you have your lunch i have a uh, uh, 11 a.m 11 a.m yes it's fair she woke up at 5 a.m in the morning at 11 she was starving yes okay and tell me uh what did you have for dinner i have a um, uh, Bananas? Bananas? Platanos? Uh, I don't know. Bananas, yeah. Fried bananas? Uh-huh. Bananas and beans. And beans? Okay. And eggs. Oh, a typical, like a typical well, food. Okay, with yes. a cup of coffee. Yes. Okay. Okay, I was expecting, no, another one that I had pupusas. No, my goodness. Okay, but that's okay. Okay, thank you so much for sharing your day. And okay. now you're ready for today's uh, English class. All righty. Who else I'm going to ask? Uh, 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 uh. Abel Edemilson. How are you, Mr. Salazar? Hi. Oh, oh my Good goodness. Morning. Yeah, your volume is really hard. Okay, yeah. Hi. <laughs> Tell me, what did you do today? <laughs> Tell us about your day. Sorry? Tell us about your day. At what time did you wake up today? I wake up around 6 a.m. You woke up at 6. Okay. All righty. At what time did you have yes. for lunch? I have lunch around 12 or 1 p.m. So between 12 and 1. Okay. And what about your dinner? Do you already have your dinner? Or no? Dinner, I uh, have um, mm -hmm. 8 p.m. Oh, okay. So what did you eat? Yeah. I ate... Um, you ate? Uh, I ate... Um, Pupusa. No. <laughs> pupusa. Another one that ate pupusa. Okay, so we have three volunteers already. Yes. Uh-huh. I live <laughs> I live in Planet Durantero. Oh, so that's the reason why you do have a lot of pupusarias near your place. Okay. And do you drink a cup yes. of coffee, a hot chocolate, a coke or what? Or water? I drink, I drink coffee. Drunk coffee, okay. Okay, very good, excellent. You're paying yeah. attention, right guys? Hopefully you do. Uh -huh. uh, 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 uh. Georgina Cruz, can you hear me? Hey, Georgie. Yes, hi, teacher. Hey, hi. We are talking about and we're discussing about how's our day going so far. So tell us, what did you do today? At what time did you wake up? Uh, my, my day is a little busy. Uh, mm -hmm. I wake up at 7 o'clock. You woke up, okay. Relax, wake up at uh, 6. And uh, I, I work online. Okay, me too, yes. Mm -hmm. I send my class to my uh, to athlete. Okay. She sent, she, uh, she sent me videos. She sent me videos. And I, I see... You saw mistakes. 
you saw and mistakes, mistakes. Okay. And I I do corrections. Oh, very good. At what time did you have your lunch? I have my lunch at uh, twelve. No, twelve noon. Okay. Uh -huh. And do you ready, uh, or do you ready have your breakfast, your breakfast, your um, dinner? Repeat, please. The, uh, do you already have your dinner? Did you already eat? Yes, I dinner. Okay. Uh, yes, I what dinner. did you eat? I, I eat... Um, you ate? I ate? I ate beans, fries. Fried beans, okay. Bread, mm -hmm. cream, okay. Uh, eggs, <laughs> revueltos, no sé. Scramble, scramble eggs. Scramble eggs. Scramble eggs. Scramble eggs. Yes. Oh, that's nice. So almost a typical love, food, right? I love drink coffee. Ah, we got another one. Okay, very good. Excellent. And one more participant, my big thing, sorry, no participant. Ruth Patricia, how are you, my lady? Hi, Ruth. How are Pretty you? good. I'm so happy Hi. to see you. Hi. Can you please tell us about yesterday, your day? <laughs> I yesterday have problem on uh, internet. Mm -hmm. Um today have problem uh, connecting oh, wow um, i yes but i'm happy that i can I'm, see you and i can meet you you're here so that's nice gracias nice to meet you nice to meet you Ruth. can you please tell us a little bit of how was your day at what time did you wake up um, i i wake up um 4 a.m you woke up at four. Wow. Earlier yes. than Erica. Yes, Oof. I wake up. Okay. At one time <laughs> yes, did you I did you have your lunch? What about your lunch? At one time um, did you have your lunch? I um I have my lunch is uh twelve o'clock. Twelve noon, okay. What about your dinner? Mm, dinner um, in uh, 7 p.m. At 7 p.m.? Okay, what did you eat? Yes. Ah, it's uh, um, beans, eggs, um, I don't know, uh, chicken. Chicken? Beef. I don't okay. know. Okay. It's a, uh, yes. All right, yes. <laughs> but the way do you live in oh. San Miguel or in San Vicente? Oh, only coffee. Oh, no, I live in Santa Tecla. <laughs> oh, okay, but you combine like like the the way that San Vicente's um, people eat, right? Because in the morning or in the afternoon, they usually combine meat with beans or something like that, right, to give more energy for protein, right, Georgie? <laughs> protein a, in my work is a very hard oh okay yes, you understand i'm working and i is oh. in my work is a is a new Ooh. new drinking water and uh, say what service mm -hmm. i have to yeah. dig uh no sé cómo se dice hoyo yeah no sé hold se dice a hold it's a uh, tengo que abrir un hoyo you Ajá, need to yes. open oh, holes uh, okay I, Yes, open holes um, is a street. Oh, so basically okay. your your job uh, uh, requires a lot of physical activity, right? Yes, mm -hmm. uh, my work is a uh, work main. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes, very physical. So definitely you yes. need more protein and energy to work out. Yes, I understand yeah. that. Yes. Very good. Yes, yes I remember yes. that I used to mm -hmm. give classes at the airport for some students that they work at the airport and basically they were uh, having their lunch at 9 30 a.m in the morning you cannot imagine the classroom it smells really good it smells chicken it has spaghetti you know uh, scrambled eggs oh my goodness that was amazing <laughs> a lot of flavors because <laughs> if they do not eat at that time they won't be able to eat the whole day. And they ate exactly like the way Ruth eat. 
that exactly like the way he eat, she yes. is because they need a lot of carbs and protein so they can do their physical job. Imagine at an at, at airport, it is really hot. It is really hot. And besides yes, that, you do a physical hot. activity. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so I understand that perfectly. Yeah. yeah. I was in the hair conditioner the whole day, but they don't. <laughs> so I understand that. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's really difficult. Okay, guys, if you were paying attention, let me ask you a question. Okay, very good. Florcita, Flor, how are you, my girl? <laughs> okay, Flori, uh, let me ask you a quick question, really quickly. There were three of your classmates that said that they had for dinner pupusas with a cup of coffee. Who were them? Flori, we, I cannot hear you. I think you have your microphone in silence. Can you hear her, guys? No? Hello. Yes, very good. Thank you. Um, Marlon? Marlon, yes. Juan? Yeah. Uh, Abel? Oh, yes, very good. And you're missing one more. Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> oh, come on. Help her, guys. Who was the third one? Hermes. Um, Hermes, very good. All righty. Who said that woke up at 4 a.m. in the morning? Maria Corpeño. Oh, 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 Abel. Okay, yes, Abel. You have the answer. Go ahead. <laughs> Uh, Ruth Patricia. Yeah, very good. Give it a five, man. Very good. Uh, uh, what is the second girl that wakes up really early morning? She said that she wakes up every day at 5 a.m. Erica. Erica, very Erica. good. All righty. Okay, there were three people actually that had like, a, we can say like a typical Salvadorian food for dinner. But actually, this girl has something different. Okay. Your, um, do you remember what Georgina had for dinner today, Wilfredo? Um, that was tough. Uh, Don't help her. Mm -hmm. Beans? Beans? Yes. Very good. Beans? Um... X. What? X. Cheese? Uh huh. No, X. Huevos. Uh, eggs. X. Yes. It, ah, come on, don't help her. <laughs> okay, very good. Yes, a scrambled eggs, exactly. What else? Uh, she likes uh, coffee. <laughs> ah, she likes a cup of coffee, exactly. But also cream and bread. Is that correct, Georgie? Yeah, you see, the teacher was paying attention. And, and, okay, and nobody will ask me, how was my day? Come on, only the teacher asked. Come on, mm -mm. it's your turn. Any volunteer? Okay, please don't, don't it, just one at a time, okay? One at a time, please. Nobody, teacher, what okay. Is, what is your favorite food? My favorite food, okay, it is sushi. Me too. Really? Yeah. Yeah, give me top five, man. Okay, any questions? Any other questions? Hey. About my day. We're practicing simple pass, guys. We're practicing simple pass. How was your day, teacher? Okay, pretty good. Pretty hard, but pretty good, actually. Do you marry? Yes, I am. So I'm sorry. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> like, mm, uh. what time do you wake up? Wake up. What time did I wake up? Okay, today. Today I woke up at six thirty. Today. Mm -hmm. Early. Yes, early. I start my shift at seven a.m. in the morning, and I ended up at five from seven to five uh-huh anything else we're practicing simple class 
did you take a break uh, in the late teacher? Something yes. like to drink a coffee or a bread? Oh, yes, definitely. I have to. For example, I have 15 minutes break in the morning and another 15 minute breaks in the afternoon. And I do have one hour of lunch. Oh, okay. You have mm -hmm. too many time of break. Yes, of course. What do you lunch? <laughs> What? Eat for lunch. What do you eat for lunch? Today it was like um, beans, a piece of fresh cheese, a green salad, a, uh, two tortillas, and uh, I think like a fried chicken, and uh, a water with lemon. That's it. Oh, and of course, a cup of coffee. In the noon? Yes. It's much. Yes. Do you do you cook? Yes, of course. No. Well, you uh, uh, you can ask my husband. My husband is a little bit chubby because I I cook a lot. <laughs> and <laughs> yes, yeah, and I love to eat. Yes, actually, I love to cook. Great. Where mm -hmm. do you learn to speak English? Ooh, well. That was back, well, I have to let you know that since three years old, I've been listening English. Mm. Because of the, um, the job of my father, my father's job. But actually, I just started learning English like, like a subject, right? Uh, from when I was eight years old until 14 years old. All my siblings speak English. And basically... Um, all my jobs have been related to English, all of them. So you can say that I can say that from three years old, I'm 30 something years old, right? I'm 30 something, almost 40, but no, 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 close to that. No, no yet. Okay. So basically my whole life I've been speaking English. I can say that is my second language. My, between, between the Spanish, second and first, they are like this, they're close. I speak English and Spanish since I was uh, three years old. Lucky me, right? <laughs> yeah, but no. Yeah, that's why. And I love it. I love it. Okay. okay. And I had tuna sandwich for dinner, okay? Yes. Tuna, tuna sandwich. Mm. Tuna sandwich. They were really good. Yes. With a uh, mm -hmm. hot tea. All righty. Okay, uh, you see, Georgina said, yes, very good, healthy. Yes, you see, Georgie? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, yeah, I'm trying to put in practice uh, my nutritionist <laughs> information. Okay, very good. Guys, do you remember what we saw yesterday? No. Yes? No, yeah, Wilfredo, I'm come on. <laughs> I'm Adjectives. for adjectives. Exactly. Hey, did, did I give you a hunger by the way? Yes, I did, right? Yes. Uh, do you think ah, the teacher is not going to remember the hunger? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. I remember that I sent you, or I asked you, right, to, to take a screenshot about it. And uh, basically, it were like, five no six adverbs do you remember six of them and i ask yes. you to make a sentence with each of them mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. hopefully you have done your homework right who's going yeah. to start okay thank you so much for participating caesar thank you how are you yeah. <laughs> you're like oh my god <laughs> look at caesar's face <laughs> oh my god yes i knew it right <laughs> <laughs> okay, Caesar. Uh huh. Yes. Okay. Do your best, Caesar. Uh, I don't understand. Nah, you don't understand. Come on. <laughs> do your best. Did you do your homework? Homework. Yes. Or no. No. Ah, okay. Okay. Don't worry about it. Okay. But pay attention, okay? Because I'm going to ask your other classmates so you can also listen how they do it and you're going to present the homework tomorrow, okay? Okay. Uh -huh, but you're going to do it. <laughs> That's okay, Cesar. Don't worry. All right. Very good. Um, let me check. Marlon, 
Did you do your homework? Yes, it's right. Okay. Can I have an example, please? Okay. These sentences have two examples. Okay, cool. Uh, today was a hard day. I feel very tired. It was a day somewhat busy. Mm -hmm. Very good. Excellent. Another one is now nowadays don't to wear face mask. It's something extremely dangerous. Okay. So take the right measures. It's really important. Okay. Very good. Okay. Another one. Listening to music in English. It's fairly good to extend your vocabulary. Very good. Okay. And the final one is I'm pretty sure that I will learn a lot in these places. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Okay, so you have an idea, right, Caesar? All, all that you have to do is to use the adverb. In this case, it is fairly, right? Somewhat, uh, very, extremely, before an adjective. It could be big, it could be a small, it could be pretty, etc. Okay, and just make a sentence, okay? Simple sentence, okay? I know that Marlon looks like he's like, Technician, he's a technician, of course, yeah, so it's different, right? But that's okay. Yes, yeah, just a simple question, okay? So I will need it for tomorrow, right? Okay, cool. All right, Herbert, did you do your homework? <gasps> or no? Hello, Herbert. Uh, do, do you call me? Teacher, do you yes, call me? of course, yes. I'm sorry, but I, I, I confused, what, but Don't worry. when you call me Hermes, Oh, yes. Because, okay, um, I'm right at six. Cool, sentence. excellent. The first is, I don't really care. You don't really care, okay, okay. Straight to the point, all right. It was really good. Okay. Uh, El Salvador is a pretty country. Very good. He played golf fairly well. He plays golf very well. Remember, it's a third person, so you got to add that place. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Uh, she is very pretty. Thank you. Uh -huh. <laughs> um, okay. It's extremely big. Very good. Mm -hmm. That's all. That's all. That's very good. Excellent. You're missing one. That's okay. Don't worry. Every, very good job. Excellent. Uh, Francisco, what about you? Hi, teacher. Hi. Okay. It's your time to participate. Okay. In my case, uh, the number one is uh, my work is hard. It's really interesting. Mm -hmm. And number two, uh, my children are very funny. Uh, number three, my mom's car is uh, extremely loud. Mm -hmm. uh, and number four, the San Vicente City is very big and pretty. Uh, number four, uh, five, the San Miguel City is a fairly hot. And uh, let me see, final. Uh, my computer is new, but it's somewhat slow. Very good. Excellent job. Amazing job. I'm so happy. Woohoo! You see? Very good job. Uh, Excellent. Uh, all righty. Who else? <laughs> okay. Maria Corpeño, what about you? Did you do your homework? Maria is not here, I think. I can say Houston, we do have a problem here. <laughs> All righty. Hi. Oh, yes. Hi, Hi how teacher. are you? <laughs> okay, yes, did you do your homework? Yes, sir. I have a problem with the with, uh, internet. Oh, okay. I understand. No, uh -huh. no see the, the instruction mm -hmm. for homework. Okay, so to, uh, today, uh, you and Cesar, you have a, a homework. You, you, uh, I want you to go to the uh, list of you two, you will be able to see the, the video for yesterday's class is uh, is uploaded in the dates. Okay, and I want you okay. to double check the video of yesterday's class. And based on that, you need to make the homework for tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Now, okay. Don't worry. Everything's Work. going okay. to be alright. Look, Caesar face like, 
Oh my God. What a teacher I have. Mm -hmm. I'm just kidding. <laughs> All righty, Carmen Irene, you look so pretty today. Okay. Do you do your homework today? <laughs> yes, teacher. All righty, let's listen to you, my girl. Uh, you are extremely crazy. Yes, I am. I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I am very important person. Yes, you are. I really miss you. Thank you. I am pretty. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Excellent. That's, that's really nice. Excellent job. Yvette <laughs> Alexandra Rivera, how are you, girl? Fine. Fine. Did you do your homework, by the way? This is my first class. Oh, your first class. Okay. Yes. So the same uh, guidance of Caesar and Maria, okay? Check yesterday's video, and based on that, you're going to do the homework for tomorrow. Okay, so don't okay. worry about that. Everything's okay. going to be all right, okay? That's good. But just listen to what your classmates are saying so you have a, a better idea, okay? Very okay. Good. Linda, Xiomara, what about you? Hello, teacher. Hello. Now it's uh, your turn. Okay. Uh, the first is... Paratrooperings is extremely dangerous. Mm -hmm. Panama is a very beautiful country. Yes, it is. This book is really heavy. Oh. This movie is pretty good. Mm -hmm. And he plays football fairly well. And somewhat is for me difficult. But... And his arguments were somewhat confusing. All right, very good. Excellent job. Amazing. Very good job. You know what? I'm going to take advantage. You see, I'm happy. <laughs> All right, very good. Yes, you see, with Fredo claps as well. All righty. <laughs> very you, good. You see, I'm going to uh, to take uh, information of what um, Linda said today, because have you heard, guys, that she used the word bat? But yes. How you use them? Have you heard, for example, the word bat in yeah, ah. Aldo, et cetera, yes. Okay, do you know how we call them in English? No, any idea? No, no, no. Ricardo, Gisilberto, Luis, Adalia, Raquel, Herman, Juliana, any idea? Erica, no. Connector. And Connector. No exactly connector. connectors. Yes, they, they, they are the function of connectors, but they do not call connectors. Yes, but yeah, they are similar. Yes, Norberto, similar to that idea. Ricardo? Can you repeat the, can you repeat the, 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 the question? question, please? Yes. For, I was uh, asking, good, uh, good night, Ricardo. I was asking you if you know the words and, mm -hmm. although, bad, etc. Norberto said that they are connectors, and yes, they have that function. But uh, conjug conjugation? Yeah, sure. uh -huh, uh -huh. Yes, Norberto? Uh, linking words? No, they are not linking words, yeah. The linking words is another thing, but, it, but this, are, this uh, works kind of like that. I think Erika mentioned something, or Linda. Conjugations? Conjunctions. Conjunctions? Conjunctions, okay. yeah. <laughs> Exactly. Conjunctions in Spanish. Conjunciones. Conjunctions. Conjunctions. Okay, guys, I know that you have not studied language since like a long time ago, right? But do you remember when do we use conjunctions or for what reasons? Any idea? Juliana, German, Fernando, I know, I don't know. Wilfredo, Georgie, no? No. No, Flor? Okay, to connect, to connect ideas, okay? So that's why I, I uh, t told Roberto that it has that function, but they call conjunctions. Okay, we have a lot of conjunctions. Like in Spanish, we have a lot of conjunctions. In English as well, 
that today, guys, we're just going to see not all of that conjunctions. Actually, we are going to see a four of them. We're going to see the conjunction and, but, thought, and however. Okay? That's what we're going to see. And we're going to understand how do we use it. Okay? Alrighty? So, would you like to start this challenge for today? Yes. Okay, cool. All righty. So allow me just a couple of minutes. Let me open right now my screen a little bit. There you go. And let me know as soon as you're able to see my screen. Okay, guys? Cool. Can you see it? Yes? Yes. Or no? Yes? yes, yes okay. Yes. Uh, I would like to put it a little bit bigger so it will be easier for you to, to see it. Okay, let me just a couple of minutes. All righty. Is it much better now? Yes? yes? Or no? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Guys. Yes. All right. Cool. Thank you. So, this is a, take a look at the first sentence. I want you guys to pay attention on this one. What is the conjunction that we are seeing right now? And. And, exactly. What does it mean in Spanish? Exactly. Okay. But take a look at the sentence, guys. Okay. Tell me, let's double check something. Let's do it together. Okay. Here we're talking about the city, is that correct? It sounds okay. Yes. yes, what we're saying about the city that the city is nice. exciting, Sorry. right? Uh huh. Nice. All right. And also, we're talking about the weather of the city. What we're saying about the weather? It's nice. It's nice. Nice. It's nice. It's nice. Okay, so we're talking about the city and we're talking about the weather of the city. Okay, tell me, if I'm saying that something is exciting, is positive idea or negative idea? Positive. 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 All right. Positive. What about I'm saying the weather is nice? Is this positive or negative? Positive. 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 All right. Okay, guys, why I'm asking you that? Because we are going to use the conjunction and... When we would like to join, guys, or two positive ideas or two negative ideas, okay? So the first idea has to be positive and positive. And if we're going to talk about negative things, the first thing has to be negative and the second one negative, okay? Okay. So so you said the weather is, is nice and the city is exciting, okay? Is that correct? Can, can, can somebody give me an idea? Give me a, an example using and. E. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead. It's a city. Mm -hmm. It's delicious and very cheaper. Okay, and cheaper. Very good. Excellent. You see, you are saying two positive things: delicious and cheaper. Okay. Excellent. Any other uh, example? Any other volunteer? Erika? Uh, the weather is nice. No. Mm -hmm. Yes. No, no. We can use that. Oh, the, 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 the rain is nice and the weather is a very cold. Yeah, very good. Excellent. You're saying two positive things, right? That is yeah. nice and cold. All right. Can I, can I have somebody who can give me an example with negative ideas using and? Mm. This, the shop is, mm -hmm. is, uh, is good mm -hmm. and, and, and don't like it because, uh, because it's very, uh, has uh, has much salt. Okay, but you said you are using one positive and one negative. And now one, you you have to use and with or with two positive ideas or two negative ideas. Has to be the same. Okay. Okay. So give me give me another example with and. I know you can do it. 
<laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. I try. You'll try. I'll try. Do your best. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the possibility okay. is uh, negative. Yeah, okay, yes. Two negative okay. ideas. Yeah, that's. Um, the table is 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 is, uh, is made uh, with with uh, good good mm-hmm. and a, a very very small. Ah, okay. So you so if you would like to use wood as an adjective, because remember that you have to use an adjective. Okay, exciting oh. is an adjective. So you said the table is wooden. And a small, okay? A small. Very good, excellent job. But guys, take, can you please take a note that when we are dividing the two ideas, because this guys is one idea, right? And after N, we have the other idea. Is that correct? But we are joining the two ideas to become one. Do you see what it? what is a little part that goes before the word and, the conjunction and? What do you have before the, that? The coma? little part, comma. A comma? A comma. Um, that is really important. Okay. Um, maybe in Spanish, maybe we forgot punctuation. But in English, no. In English, it's really important that you use the punctuation. So in this case, guys, if you are starting a sentence, you need to use a capital letter. If you're finished a sentence, you need to use a period. And in this case, since we are combining two ideas into one, we must put a comma before the conjunction all the time. Okay? Never forget that. Never forget that. Are we clear okay. on that? Yes? I got it. You got it. Very good. It. Excellent. Okay, now, guys, there is another conjunction, and Linda mentioned it today. Basically, is this one? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh yes, this one. Do you remember this that she but. mentioned that? It's but, okay. But. But. Okay. Exactly. But. Take a look at this. Take a look at the expressions. It's a big city. Okay. And it's not too big. Okay. You see that? Okay. What you said? Okay, it is or is not, right? Okay, but guys, take a look at this one. The first part, am I saying something positive or something negative? Positive. 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 Uh-huh. And what about the second part? Uh, the negative. Is it negative? Negative. negative. Basically, guys, I'm making like a contrast, right? Yeah. I'm making like a contrast. Okay. So if you would like to make a contrast, or if you want to use positive with negative or negative with positive, you're going to use the conjunction but, okay? But, but. for example, mm-hmm. uh, you can say that restaurant food is really delicious, but very expensive. For example, can you give me an example okay. using bad, uh, Fernando? Or Luis? Me. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Me? Yes. Yeah, oh, okay. Uh, it's a nice, it's a nice city, but it's very dangerous. All righty, very good. Excellent job. Another example, Brody? Yes, another example with but? My phone is... Your phone is breaking up? My phone is cheap. Okay. But it's really slow. Very slow. good. Excellent. Carmarina uh, Irene, can I have another example, please? Um, the pupusas is very delicious, but, mm-hmm. but you don't eat. Okay, the pupusas, uh, we're talking about singular or plural, Carmen? Uh, plural. So it's is or are? 
Uh, the pupusas are. Very good. Excellent. I know that you knew it. Very good. <laughs> Just a little refresh. Very good. Uh, Norberto, any other example, please? Uh, um, With pet. Um, I like to travel, but I don't have enough money. Okay, that's a good one. <laughs> Very good. Excellent. Excellent job. Okay, guys. Now, take a look at this part, the left side. We have thought and however. Oh, and before we go that, remember, guys, that it, but is the same with and, okay? Never forget the comma, okay? Okay, but yes. guys, can you see that these conjunctions are at the end? Yes? Yes. Okay. I saw. Okay. I mean, yes. One of the difference is that these conjunctions cannot be uh, in the middle. It has to be at the end. Only this one, however, it could be at the beginning. Okay? That is one. One of the difference. Also, do you see that we have commas here? Yes? Yes. Yes. It's a point. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Exactly. All right. If there's another difference, what do you think? So, we see it not so, Take yeah. a look. So, mm -hmm. so think about it. Uh, it's is a a not to be. And so, uh -huh. no. Any other idea? Don't worry. We're about to see that. I just want to, I just want you to to think the a little bit. So, mm -hmm. okay. It very has good. It's a big. Uh -huh. Very good. Excellent. You have done a tremendous job. All right. It's okay. a big city. It's a positive. Mm -hmm. Okay, let, let me do a recap here. Let me go Maybe, here. sorry, teacher. Go ahead. Maybe, do you have more example that thought? Mm -hmm. Yes. And the other, please? Yes, that's no, that's what I'm showing you right now. Did you see my screen? Yes. In okay. Moment, yes. Okay, so in this case, can Thank you please you. be so kind? Thank you, uh, girl. Could you please be so kind to read for me? the little purple square about thought and however can you read it yes okay Hi. juliana ah. okay 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 go ahead erica who can okay. help me read who can help me read I, it okay this, go ahead go ahead sure these two conjunctions, conjunctions? conjunctions. Mm -hmm. these two conjunctions are also used to connect a positive idea with a, ne with a negative yeah. idea, mm -hmm. but they go at the end of the sentence. Exactly. They go at the end of the sentence. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And for example, you see, so this one, guys, the difference will be that they have they're going to go at the end of the sentence so you can use uh, a positive and negative okay but always at the end and we have an example here it's a big city it's not too crowded thought you know what crowded is yeah a lot of noise i i know a lot of people, uh, a lot a lot of people. Mm -hmm. exactly okay. and we have another example here uh with however He's really good looking. That means that he's handsome, guys. He is not nice, however. Es un tipo bonito, pero no, no cae muy bien. Okay? You see? Always. Affirmative and negative. Mm -hmm. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. However. So do you have However. a better idea how do we use them? Yes? Any questions so far? So far, maybe more examples, please. Yes, of course. Who said maybe more examples? Joe. 
Linda. I cannot see you, Linda. Me apologize. <laughs> oh, yes. For example, the only difference is that, okay, now I can see you. Thank you, baby. Alrighty. So the only difference with however in thought is that also you can combine two ideas, positive and negative or negative or positive. But the thing is, in what position of the sentence you put the conjunction. Okay. However, in thought, they're going to be at the end, at the end of the sentence. And before the end of the sentence, you got to separate it with coma. Okay. And then but. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly, yeah. Ricardo. There you go. So you have a, a new homework. Isn't it amazing? <laughs> Yay, right? Ay, Ricardo said, why am I asking? Why am I asking? And everybody will say, let's finish John's English cancer. You will see, Ricardo. You will see. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. All righty, guys. So your homework will be easy peasy queasy, right? Like a piece of cake, as always. Okay. Yeah. I just want one example for each of them, and that's it. Okay. And do you remember that you were supposed to send me that today's homework through the WhatsApp so I can double check the writing? Okay. <laughs> and you forgot, right? <laughs> and Florida is like, oops. All righty. So now I will need this exercise, please, so I can double check the writing because I need to double check if you're using punctuations. Okay. Yes. You know what? In Spanish, I don't care how you write, but in English, yes. For me, it's okay. really important, that punctuation. It's really important because if you're going to learn a new language, you're going to learn it in a great, in a good, in a correct way. Okay? okay. So for me, punctuation is really important. I do care about commas, semicolons, question marks, exclamation marks, and... Uh, capital letters, lower cases, I do care about that. For me, it's really important because, for example, imagine that you need to send an email to a coworker, to your boss, to the CEO, to a student or whatever. You need to have a good grammar. Yes? A good grammar. Yes. So that's why it's really important to learn how to write it correctly. Okay. And in my opinion, it's really important, okay? You know why I'm telling you that? Because sometimes, for example, when you go to the platform and you would like to, to do the exercises, and I have to let you know that you can do exercise for, uh, the two exercises for this unit, you will be able to do it already. So please do it. That will be like a writing practice for you as well, guys. But sometimes you say, oh my God, I'm putting this thing right, and why is not accepting? Guess what? You're missing the comma. You're missing the period at the end. You forgot the capital letter. And you put too much, too many spaces between phrases. So that's why. And you forgot the apostrophe, for example. So that's why, exactly. You forgot the question mark. So that's why it's really important for me that you learn, that you understand and you learn it correctly. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 So Cesar okay. Maria and uh, who else? And Yvette, I think. Yes. They will have two hunger for tomorrow. Can you imagine? That's amazing, right? <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. And so any questions, guys? Any doubts, please? You can ask me right now. We have, let me check. We have one minute. <laughs> we have one minute. So any questions, feel, feel free to ask me. Okay. And Georgie, what happened with, you, with Carlos, Georgie? What happened with your husband? Is he okay? He is a little sick. Oh my God. A headache. Oh, okay. Hopefully he gets well, okay? Yeah, hopefully he does. Say hi to him, okay? That we miss him in today's class. Okay. Any yeah. questions, guys? Any doubts? Any comments? Could Maria? you please repeat the homework? Yes, Linda. I will be more Thank than glad. You're welcome. Okay, we have seen today's conjunctions, all right? We have seen the conjunction and what else, guys? But, but uh-huh, another one? So, so and however. however. 
exactly. So basically, Linda, the, uh, the homework is that I need a sentence or a sentences in this case for each conjunction using that in the correct way and do not forget punctuation. Okay? Okay. There okay. you go. Okay, so it was nice to have you. Hey, to, hey I had to remember, guys, that this course is Monday to Thursday, right? But we started on Tuesday, so this class is, oh, this week is going to end on Friday, okay? I just have to let you know that. Don't forget, okay? Because uh, the teacher will be alone on Friday. Yes. Friday. Yeah, Friday, <laughs> yeah. Yes, mm -hmm. also, the, uh, Ricardo, yes. We have Monday classes to, from, from to Wednesday. No, we oh. have classes from, normally it's from Monday to Thursday. But since uh, this Thursday. week, yeah, since this week we started yesterday, so we need to finish on Friday. Only for okay. this week. Next week it will be the same. Monday to Thursday, okay? okay? Only okay. for this week. Okay, okay. guys. So how okay. and keep this. Study yeah, and see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye teacher. Bye, teacher. bye. bye. bye guys. Yes. Bye, teacher. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.